Today we are going to be taking a look at how to create a favicon. Now if you've ever wondered how websites get the little icon that appears in the tabs, favorites, and other places, that is by creating a favicon. So to create your own favicon, you will first need to jump over into Photoshop and make a new document that is at least 16 pixels by 16 pixels. Now you don't have a ton of room, but the next step is going to be creating your actual icon itself. So I'm just going to go over and grab my custom shape tool and drag out a simple star as my favicon. So once you have your icon done, make sure and turn off your background layer so that your icon sits on a transparent background. Now go ahead and go up to File and then Save for Web and then save your file as a PNG24. Now make sure and call your file favicon.png and save it somewhere that you can find it later. Now some browsers will read a PNG as a favicon, but all browsers back to Internet Explorer 5 will read an actual icon file, so we're going to need one of those. So in order to make your own icon file, you're going to need to use some kind of converter, and so I'm going to be heading over to convertico.com. So I will go ahead and use their simple converter to convert my PNG to a .ico icon file. So just browse for your file and then press go, and then after that go ahead and click to download your icon. Now go to wherever your browser stores downloaded files and just drag the icon file into the images folder of your website. Now again, make sure that it is named favicon.ico. So now it's a simple process of linking this file in the head of your HTML document. So go ahead and flip over to Dreamweaver and make some space before the closing head tag for your code. Now there are two lines of code to be sure that your favicon will show up in both new and old browsers. So start by typing out open bracket link space rel equals and then two sets of quotes and then a space and then href equals and then two sets of quotes and then a space and then a forward slash and a closing bracket. So now in your first set of quotes you're just going to type shortcut space icon. Now in the second set of quotes the href we're going to type in images forward slash favicon.ico. So this basically tells the link tag that we want to link to an icon file and basically where the icon file is. So once you're done with that, go ahead and copy that line and just paste it on the line below. Now the only thing we need to change on this line is to change shortcut icon to only icon. So this will ensure that your favicon will now show up in all new and old browsers. So that's it for the code. So now all you need to do is save your file and then run your page and you should see your brand new favicon in your browser. Now keep in mind that if you do change an existing favicon, you may need to clear the browser cache in order to see the new one right away. So there you have it, that's how you create and add a favicon to your web page. So as always, if you enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to subscribe, rate, comment, and share it with your friends.